Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels, or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle Channel. Today I'm going to be doing a vlog on the top 10 latest travel news facts worldwide, part 2, 2021. So let's jump right into it. Now according to breakingtravelnews.com, I have gone got 10 fantastic brand new travel facts so i'm going to fire away with number one uh, which is uh, pata predict a full recovery may take three years unfortunately maybe they're not saying it's definite and um, the pacific asia travel association has predicted that um, even the base case scenario visitors numbers to the region will still be below 2019 levels in the next two years time that's unfortunate but at least um, if it's got the visitor numbers are going in the right direction um, at least um, there's a light at the end of the tunnel in three years time um, for the region so um, again um, it's not to uh, again good news or it's not bad news but um, there's a light at the end of the tunnel and um, number two minor, uh, minor eyes um, China expansion with a fun yard partnership minor hotel global spanning network of properties ensure that the group is well poised for development and um, in a chinese market where the appetite for leisure travel has never been greater apparently so that's good news for china and um their tourism industry for yard partnership and news um travel news so again i hope it goes as well as possible number three singapore airlines to launch a covid testing trial and um, all passengers flying singapore airlines outbound from singapore to indonesia bound for singapore will be able to look at pre-departure polymer race chain reaction um rt pcr and zero logic zero logity test excuse my pronunciation um so that's really good news for singapore and singapore airlines and people uh, traveling to and for, from singapore that um, you can get a covid 19 tests um, number four united airlines report unfortunately a 7.1 billion loss for the financial year of 2020 so again that's not good but hopefully in the future that will bounce back up um, and they'll be making gains um, number five, uh, Norwegian Airlines welcome financial support of the Norway government airline news. So really good news uh, for Norwegian Airlines uh, because they're getting support from the Norwegian government. Yay, exciting. Um, and I hope it builds back up to what it was in the future. Um, number six, Malvern peak hotel harbour to take brand new the brand to australia wow that's really interesting so that's really good news for australia and uh, Moulton peak hotel change so i hope it goes as well as possible um 
in the future. Number seven, uh, Qatar Airways expands Iberia Airlines co-chair partnership. So that's really good news for both Iberia and, Iberia and Qatar Airways. And um, Marriott Hotel sign to bring the Ritz Carlton to Zermatt um, in Switzerland. So we hope it's really good news for Zermatt, Marriott and the Ritz Carlton Hotel chain. Uh, fingers crossed um, it'll go as well as possible. And number nine, Dominican Republic to offer free COVID-19 tests to travellers. Really, again, good news uh, for people uh, looking to uh, from other countries to go to the Dominican Republic because they can get a absolute free COVID-19 test, which is really good news. And last but not least, I... AG agrees to half price Air Europa deal. Wow, that's going to be really good news for IGA and um, Air Europa and obviously customers are wanting to travel on Air Europa um, can get a half price deal. Wow, so that's fantastic news. So I would like to say thank you for watching, please subscribe, it's the red and white subscription button, I upload five times a week and um, if you click the notification bell um, it will give you every time I upload a video, um, which, which again what I've said is five times a week, love speaking about tra travel and lifestyle and um i'll see you tomorrow um for my travel and lifestyle updates and improvements um vlog tomorrow at half past six so thank you for watching and bye for now take care everybody bye